Our story starts like many stories in a small town. This one in Indiana. Our story focuses on five kids that suddenly gain magical abilities. Their lives go from normal to magical in the blink of an eye. Each of the kids comes from a different walk of life. Elizabeth, the new girl in town, having just moved from California due to her father's new job as a local priest, has to suddenly deal with the fact that she can now relate to his work in unimaginable ways. Ariza, she's the most popular girl in school. She's gotten everything she wanted in life. Life was handed to her on a silver platter, but now she can call the forces of nature. She realizes she has to have more control of herself than ever before. She's also the first to realize her abilities. Violet is the incoming freshman. Life is pretty typical for this freshman. Locker stuffing, being bullied, but she's about to gain wings to fly. She will soar to heights never imagined. Mauve is the loner. She only has one friend in school. She really doesn't know how to cope being herself in life, but she isn't going to have to worry about that for very long, because soon she could be anyone she wants to be. Wade. He's a guy with a secret. Wade is Mauve's best friend. He is inside. He is hiding a deep secret from his best friend, but little does he know that he has more secrets than he can ever imagine. Soon it's going to be like he's there, not even there at all. Now the powers that they obtain are from an ancient line of enchantresses. There was an enchantress who tried to kill the rest of the enchantresses. And one day, one of the enchantresses that was still living siphoned out five of the sister spirits and sent these spirits into the future. And now these five spirits are in the bodies of these five kids. Taya is the name of this enchantress. She's going to try her best to mentor these children in her, their abilities. But there's still a darkness that looms over the children. The other enchantress who tried to kill the old order still lives. Syriana will stop at nothing to see to see the destruction of these children by her own hands. And who is the Dark Master? And what role does he play in all of this? Everyone has a secret. Everyone has a mystery. Welcome to another beautiful morning.